Hello everyone, welcome to my second uh, class for uh, learning Chinese strokes. Well, today we are going to learn another eight strokes. Let's look at the first one. The first one name is Xie Go. Xie Go. It is from the top and down to the right and make a small hook. Xie Go, the name of this stroke. So in this example, it is here. Well, this word read as wo. Wo means I. You already learned ni means you. Now this is I. Well, this one, shu ti, its name is shu ti because it is uh, first you make a shu and then with a little tick, ti, shu ti. So in this word is here, hen, hen means very, pretty much. This one, first you make horizontal, hong, and then you fold down. So the name of this stroke is hong zhe, hong zhe. Well, in this word, it is here, it is here. So actually this part is almost like a, a perpendicular, but this is one stroke, so we say it's a fold, hong zhe. Well, this word means ko, means mouth. Read as ko means mouth. We also uh, used it in a public place to say it's entrance or exit. This one is a short shoe and then fold. So in this example, it's here. The name of it is Shu Zhe. Shu Zhe. So this word means um, picture or used as a verb, drawing. Read as Hua. Hua. Well, this one, you first make a pie and then make another uh, stroke like a dot. Actually, it is one stroke. Pie dian. This dot is a big dot, not uh, as small as the first uh, um, uh, stroke, the dot we learned. So this is a big dot. So in this example, is here. Actually, it is often this stroke is often used in, in this structure. This part of the word, this half of this word means woman, lady. Well, this word means good, very good. Hao, read as hao. Well, this one also you make a pie first. And then fold it. Pie zhe. Pie zhe. Uh, this one is shu zhe. This one is pie zhe. You can see this is not a, a straight um, upright vertical, not a straight vertical. So we call it pie zhe. It's here in this word. This word read as qu means gang. Leave, go away, go. This one, first make a short hung, horizontal, and then down to the left. Hung pie, hung pie. In this word, is here. Well, this word read as hand, hand, and it is a, uh, a, uh, it means, uh, for example, China, the majority of Chinese people are Han people. It is this word, Han. And the last stroke is 
first shu and then gui. Well, well, you will see it's not shu zhe but shu gui, and in English it is perpendicular and turn. This turn it is almost like a, a horizontal, almost like a hung. So we see it's gui. So here in this word, it is this part. And this word read as mang. Mang means busy. Busy. Now please read the names of these shooks after me. Xie go. Xie go. Shu ti. Shu ti. Hong go. I'm sorry. Hong zhe. Hong zhe. Shu zhe. Shu zhe. Pie dian. Pie dian. Pie zhe. Pie zhe. Hong pie. Hong pie. Shu gui. Shu gui. Now, um, I give more uh, characters as an example to show these strokes in the word. So, and also be familiar with how you write it from the top and then to the left down, to the right down, and then make a hook. So, in this word, it's here. And this word read as dai. Dai means generation. Almost looks like the same, just without this pier, right? So this word me read as fa. Fa. Uh, it uh, describes something, some action uh, in wars or in in a battlefield. Fa. And this word is xi. Xi means opera, all kinds of opera. And this word means uh, read as zhan. Zhan means fight or war. This stroke, shu ti, first from top down and then make a small hook to the right. In in here, this word ji ji means hungry or starving. And the similar similar part in this word ge, ge, it also means starving or hungry. So these two words often used together, ji e, means the same thing, hungry. So in here, in this word is here, this word, I think you, you know how to read it. Lang, lang means wolf. And in here, in this word, it means clothes. It is uh, uh, refers to general clothes, and uh, it is read as e e. Now this is hong zhe, hong zhe from left to right and down a little bit to the uh, to the left. So here, in this word. This word read as shu means books. Shu 
books， 马马 horse， 马 horse， 张张 is a popular last name in China， 张。Gong, Gong is a bow. So when you uh shoot an arrow and you stretch the bow, so this means bow. Actually, you can see this part and is the same with this word. So when this used with this part, make another word. Zhang. Well, here, this one is. <coughs> 数者，数者 ，so you can immediately see this part is same with this word. So this word with this part make another word. 先，先，先 is something related to a, a mystery story. Ah,、uh, some some figures in mystery stories. 先。山 means mountain. This part, 母母 means female, refer to anything female. And、uh, we also use it as an official name, as a mom, mother. 撇点 from top down and then to the right down, make a big dot. So it often used in this word. Woman. So this also refer to woman. This also refer to woman. This read as 女女 This read as 姐姐 means elder sister. This read as 她 means she. But this word is means last name. So when you fill in a form. You see this word, so you fill in your last name. And this one, 撇 first 撇 and then 者 in here. So this word 松 means pine tree. 松 also refers to when you tie something onto something else, and you did not make it tight, it loose. So also called 松 Chong means charge, like you、uh, you charge your battery. Xi read as Xi means、uh, department, something like uh, uh, in a college English department or mathematics department. Well, this one Hong Pie, Hong Pie, Hong Pie. So in this word is here. This read as you. You means again, once more. This door in this word you have two this structure. Door means many, quite a few. Who, who means each other. 餐 refers to meal. 餐树拐树拐 you can see it's used in here. This read as "qu" means district. District. It refers to a geographical area. Qu. Kuang. Kuang is a last name in Chinese in Chinese language. Wang. Wang means die. Died. Died. And this part, together with this word, make another word, also read, Wang. But it is a、uh, fourth tone. Wang means forget. Wang. Okay. So so much for today's class.、Uh, if you like my class, please subscribe my channel. Thank you very much. Hope to see you next time. Bye bye.